this guy. Large sink. See this kind of fish every day. There's a lot of energy in this thing. got your priorities straight, huh? That's my boy. While you're at it, how about losing the wild hair? Fine. Uh, I'll tone it down. Around the house. You'll be going to a respectable school one day. We can't have your classmates thinking you're some renegade rock star. Okay, okay. I'll limit it to my training. School, huh? <laughs> That'll be something. Thanks to Gohan and his father, the planet was freed from Cell's evil clutches. The people of Earth were finally able to live in peace once again. However, during times of peace, people have a tendency to foolishly grow complacent. Such is the fate of mankind. About seven years had passed since the confrontation with Cell. 
This is the quiet settlement of Satan City. Here resides Mr. Satan, the man mistakenly believed to have saved the planet. The city was renamed after him for his heroism. Gohan is now 16 years old. With no schools anywhere near his country home, he had no choice but to do homeschooling. But eventually, his mother, Chi Chi, decided to send him to a high school. In Armed bandits began appearing so frequently in Satan City that Gohan began to run into them on his way to school from time to time. To combat the crime in the city, Gohan would transform into a Super Saiyan and make short work of those that disturb the peace. To protect his identity, Gohan made sure to leave the scene as quickly as possible. The mysterious hero came to be known as the Golden Fighter, and rumors quickly spread about his true identity. The Golden Fighter again, huh? Who the heck is this guy? From Super Saiyan to Superhero. That took way too long. I need to hurry. Oh man, I'm gonna be late. I have to hurry. This crime wave is getting ridiculous. You're the new guy. Gohan, is that right? I'm Erisa. Nice to meet you. And this here's Videl. You won't believe this. Videl's dad is none other than the legendary Mr. Satan. Really? M Mr. Satan? See, I told you you weren't gonna believe it. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. You were late today, weren't you? Did you happen to see the bank robbery in town? Oh, uh, I'm not sure. The Golden Fighter took out all the bandits. Uh, uh, okay. Why are you so interested in bank robberies? Well, you see, Videl's a bit of a crime fighter herself. Makes total sense though, right? She is Mr. Satan's daughter. She's really tough. The police even sometimes ask for her help. Wow, you don't say. You know, you've got the same build as the Golden Fighter. Huh? Huh, I need to do something to mask my identity. Maybe I'll ask Bulma for her input. <laughs> Look who you're talking to. This pushover's no match for a bunch of robbers. Hmm. We've got baseball practice up next, right? We'll find out if you're really tough enough to fight crime soon enough. You've got no hope of getting a hit off my pitches. <laughs> Gotta make sure I hold back most of my strength. Mom and Bulma both warned me to keep my power in check to avoid causing a huge uproar. Yeah, it sure is hard living a normal life. <laughs> Let's see how you handle my ultra fastball. I've gotta take this nice and easy. You're not getting a single hit off me! What? You actually hit my pitch? I, I just got lucky, that's all. Yeah, 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 you're right. Your stance was way off, too. Wow, so even that was too much. I'll head to Bulma's place later and ask her for some advice. Something's up with him. I need to talk to Bulma. Hopefully Bulma can help me figure something out. Huh. 
Hi, Bulma. There's something I wanted to talk to you about. Oh, hey, Gohan. What's up? Hmm. You need some sort of disguise to hide your identity. So, do you have any idea how I can do that? Of course, I am a genius, after all. Really? Please, whatever it is, I'll take it. No problem. It'll take some time, though, so sit tight. Thanks. You have no idea how much this will help me. Oh, yeah. Do you know where Trunks is? I'd like to talk to him while I'm waiting. He's probably getting whipped into shape by Vegeta in the gravity chamber. Vegeta mentioned something about making him stronger than you. Oh, yeah? Wow, he sure is intense. The gravity chamber, huh? Where was that again? Gohan! When did you get here? Not too long ago. The word on the street is that your dad's putting you through some grueling training. Yep. He promised he'd take me to the amusement park if I can land one hit on him. Really? Vegeta said that? Keep at it then. I know you can do it. Yeah. I'll make sure my dad keeps his promise. Guess I should say hi to Vegeta while I'm here. Hi, Vegeta. Sorry to interrupt. Go on. Look at you. You're out of shape. Even in times of peace, you should be training. Uh, right. Speaking of training, I hear you're teaching Trunks how to fight. I am. He's more than old enough to prepare himself for real combat by now. And he'll soon surpass you if you keep sitting on your ass like that. <laughs> oh, yeah. I gave Trunks some words of encouragement earlier. He's looking forward to going to the amusement park. <laughs> He's only going if he can manage to hit me. But that's not going to happen. Perfect timing, Gohan. <laughs> it's ready. Not fair. Make me one, Mom. Whoa! <laughs> this is great. This will definitely work. I know, right? Thank you so much, Bulma. I'm going to use this right away. Oh, never mind. I don't want one. All right, I'm heading to school now. You must really like that thing, what with you transforming all the time in the evening. Watch out for airplanes. Right. Good luck today, Gohan. You're so cool. <laughs> I know, right? This Goku lookalike is Gohan's younger brother, Goten. He is Goku's second son who was born after the defeat of Cell. Good thing I'm dressed as the great Saiyan man. Now I can fly without worrying about being seen. Plus, I'll be on the lookout for evildoers. A cinch. Ooh, this ought to be good. Hey, this looks like some high grade stuff. Flying sure makes the commute easier. This will be a cinch.
I wonder what's going on in town. Huh? What's happening? More robbers? Still want more? We ain't done yet. Kiss your butt goodbye, little girl. Whoa, I wasn't expecting that. She really is pretty strong. She's gotta be way stronger than her dad. Come on, get up! Don't tell me you're done already! Why, you little... Oh, what the... Who the hell are you? Hmm? Me? I'm the vanquisher of evil, defender of justice! The Great Sailman! Nailed it! Those two hours of practice last night paid off. How lame! Resistance is futile! Now then, Videl, let's apprehend these fiends. He knows my name? I knew it! There's no way in hell I'm letting this bozo take me in. Screw this guy! Let's pump him full of lead! Yeah, he's dead meat! Fools! Justice will always prevail! He, he's some sort of monster! About these ruffians, would you mind escorting them to the police, Videl? They're fine here. I'll make a call and have them picked up. You're pretty strong. You don't want people to know your identity, do you? Oh, uh, yes, that's correct. But are you sure you want to keep this going, Gohan? You're going to be late. Exactly. That's why I have to hurry. I knew it! Huh? You're that Gohan guy from my class, aren't you? Uh, I busted. How did you figure it out? I hit the perfect disguise and everything. Your voice, mannerisms... Plus, you knew my name. Uh, oh, yeah. Why are you wearing that ridiculous outfit anyway? Well, it's just... My friends and family just want to live normal lives. I was told to hide my strength, so... Hmm... Uh, uh, um... Uh, please don't tell anyone about this. You know, the World Tournament's in about a month. You're going to enter, right? What? The World Tournament? You don't know it? It's a competition to determine the best fighter. They're bringing it back. My dad's the previous champion, and before him it was some mysterious guy named Goku. Huh. His name's kind of similar to yours. And it's probably not just a coincidence either. You know... I bet that Goku guy is your dad! Am I right? Huh? Well, uh... Jeez, this girl sure is smart as a whip. That's what I thought. So, what do you say? You're gonna enter the World Tournament, right? Uh, well, no. I'm gonna stay out of that. I'm not really interested in competitions like that anyway. In that case, if you don't enter, I'm gonna tell everyone that you're the Great Saiyaman. 
What? Oh, come on! We have a deal? Just enter as the Great Sandman. No one will know it's you. <sighs> Fine. I'll enter the tournament. Great! Then it's settled. Finally, some competition. I was afraid I'd be up against pushovers. I've really gotten myself into a mess now. I did not see this coming. Look! We're almost at school. Oh, also, you need to teach me how to fly. It's not fair if you're the only one who can do that. Oh, uh, okay, sure. All right, I'll head in first. Man, I never imagined anyone would find out my secret this fast. And now... I have to deal with the World Tournament. I'll ask Bulma for advice after school. The World Tournament, huh? Not gonna be allowed to wear a helmet or any protective gear, but I need to cover my face somehow. Welp, time to head to Bulma's. This is great! Look at all of this energy! Wow! This place is massive! I mean, Bulma's place is pretty big, but this might be taller! launch, isn't it? What's she doing over there? Are you okay? Oh, and you are? It's me, Gohan. Oh, Gohan. What's up? Why are you wearing that outfit? It's kind of hard to explain. <laughs> Just think of me as a defender of justice. A defender of justice, you say? Anyway, what are you doing here? Oh, right. Yes, I've kind of got a little problem here, but it looks like she's not here right now. I see. Well, maybe I could help you. Oh, that would be wonderful. Would you, if you don't mind? Of course. I actually wanted to talk to Bulma about something, but seeing as she's gone, I'm free. The Great Saiyan Man, Defender of Justice, will do whatever he can to assist you. Oh, how perfect. A Defender of Justice such as yourself is just what I need right now. Oh? Huh? So, Tien asked me to look after his farm while he's away training. You know, doing chores and whatnot. But some terrible monsters showed up on the farm and started to attack the village nearby. It was awful. That's not good. So... You just need me to defeat those monsters? Yes, please. That would be wonderful. Look, here's where the village is located. Got it. I'll head over there right away. Oh, okay. Off to save the village. <laughs> I wonder if Bulma's home. So, Tien asked Launch to look after his farm, huh? Huh. I didn't know those two were so close. Wait, I remember Launch transforming into a really scary version of herself whenever she sneezes. Probably shouldn't have left her on her own. I hope she's okay.
All right. Hey, this looks like some high-grade stuff. Should be right around here. Monsters are back! Someone help us! All right, monsters, where are you? <laughs> That's one of those creatures that comes out of seeds planted in the ground. <laughs> Your village attacking days are over, evil fiends. <laughs> I am the vanquisher of all evil. <laughs> the defender of justice, the great Saiya Man. Nailed it. Here we go! Here go! Face the power of justice! Here I go! Don't belong here. Here I go. How dare you destroy this village and TNT's That should be all of them. Th thank you, stranger! How could we ever repay you? Ha ha ha! It was all in a day's work for the great Saiya Man. Where are the little freaks? Uh, uh, launch? If you're looking for the monsters, <clears throat> they're not here. I took care of them. What? So I'm too late, huh? Man, I was hoping to mess them up real good. Now, now, they're too dangerous for you to fight. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Looks like those things caused you some trouble, that's for sure. Well, I'm fine, but uh, I think a lot of the villagers are hurt. Yeah, those things made a mess of our supplies and businesses. Ah, that reminds me. Those are probably from Tien's farm. Uh, hold up a uh, uh, Oh my, where am I? Uh, launch? Oh, those are some rather tasty looking vegetables. Well, if you don't mind, I could use them to make something delicious and nutritious for everyone. What do you say? That'd be great. We'll. I'll go pick some more vegetables from Tien's farm then. Gohan, would you mind helping me? Oh, sure thing. I, uh, I mean, uh, who is this Gohan? Hmm, I'm the great Saiya Man. Oops, that's right. <laughs> oh man, your cooking's the. Yes! Yeah, the veggies were super fresh. This stuff would be a huge hit at my restaurant launch. It's the best I've ever tasted. I'm so glad you feel that way. I'd love for the dishes I make with Tian's vegetables to be enjoyed by others at a real restaurant. <laughs> I do enjoy cooking for everyone. Yeah, that's a great idea. <laughs> I need to find a way to talk about it with the other me, though. Maybe you could do that some other time. Well, then, <clears throat> I'm off. Okay. Thank you again for your help, Mr. Hmm. Balma should have been back by now. I need to get to Capsule Corporation.
wonder if Bulma's home. Oh, hey, Gohan. You here to see my mom? Sure am. Is she here by chance? Yep, sure is. Come on in. Oh, wow! You're going to enter the next world tournament? Why? Well, you see, one of my classmates is Mr. Satan's daughter. Mr. Satan? <laughs> you mean that blowhard who embarrassed himself in the fight with Cell? The world martial arts champion has a daughter and she's your classmate? Yeah, she's a good person and tough too. She helped me fight off some bad guys in town. Unfortunately, she figured out who I am. I guess my voice gave me away. She told me she's gonna tell everyone I'm the great Saiyan man if I don't enter the tournament. Well, that was pretty clumsy of you. No matter how hard you try, you'll always have that in common with your father. So, what do you need me to do? Want me to modify your helmet to mask your voice? No. Not that. I won't be allowed to wear a helmet or any other protective gear during the tournament. The rules are pretty strict about that. So, I was wondering if there was some other way of masking my true identity. Hmm. So you can't wear anything that'll significantly reduce damage, huh? Piece of cake! We just need to make sure that people won't know it's you, right? Whoa! This is great! It's simple, yet effective. Thanks. What do you think, Trunks? Pretty spiffy, right? No comment. But you know, even if you hold back a lot, you're still going to clean house. Sounds kind of boring. Oh, we'll see about that. If you're going to enter that tournament, then perhaps I should as well. What? There was a considerable gap between us before, but I do wonder how it is now. While you have been slacking off, I've been continuing my training non-stop. Uh... Yeah, and instead of training, you should have gotten a job. He's just like your dad. I swear, you Saiyans are just a bunch of lazy bums. Whoa! You and my dad are gonna fight each other? Count me in, too! <laughs> dad? That's my dad's voice. Dad! Is that... Kakarot? Yep, long time no see. I mean, here. King Kai is helping me reach all of you from Otherworld. Sounds like I'm coming in crystal clear. Dad, how have you been? Huh? Uh, not too bad. I'd say I've been doing okay. For a dead guy. Right, but can you really enter the world tournament? Yeah, most definitely. Fortune teller Baba's gonna let me come back for an entire day. You and Vegeta are gonna enter, right? Then I'm in too. All right. Huh? Hooray! I'm looking forward to that. You'd better be prepared. I've gotten a lot stronger. Same here, Vegeta. All right, guys. See you at the World Tournament. That's great news, Gohan. You should go tell your mom. Goten, Krillin, and the others. Right. <laughs> this should be interesting. Oh. Vegeta, you'll need to wear a costume like this to hide your identity. Hell no! I have no need to hide who I am. <laughs> All right, I'm off to go tell everyone. First on the list is Krillin. Hope he's at Kame House. Goku's gonna be there? No way! Well, now, it's been ages since I've seen him. The World Tournament, huh? Uh, I guess I could enter. Yeah, but if you, Goku, and Vegeta are gonna be in it, then I've got no hope of winning at all. You should still enter. Even fifth place gets a cash reward. How much cash are we talking? Oh, uh, well, the champion gets 10 million zenny. Second place gets 5 million. Third place gets 3. Fourth place, 2. So fifth place gets 1 million, I guess. We're entering the tournament, Krillin. Both of us. Yeah. Okay. Mommy and Daddy are going somewhere? That's right, Marin. Mommy and Daddy are going to work hard and earn a lot of money. Hooray! Good luck, Mommy and Daddy! 
Uh, right. Daddy's gonna do his best. Hey, don't tell Piccolo, okay? If he enters, then my chances of getting fifth place are shot. Uh, you know I can't promise that. By the way, uh, what's with the super lame getup, huh? Hey, it's not super lame. It's cool. You've lost your sense of style, Krillin. Bye. Yeah, later. Sorry, Krillin, but I've got to tell Piccolo, too. Better hurry to Kami's lookout. I wonder if Piccolo will enter. Who knows? Maybe Dende will, too. I see. Well, that sounds interesting. Right? Fine. Count me in. What about you, Dende? Oh, <laughs> I won't be entering. I'm not a warrior-type Namekian. So, Gohan, what's with the strange outfit? Aw, you too, Piccolo. What? You don't think this looks super cool? Uh, you're asking the wrong guy. All right. I'd better get back. Right. Okay, see you later! I'm sure Mom will be really happy to hear Dad's gonna be back. Even if only for one day. Man, I sure hope Mom will let me join the tournament. It'd be really nice if I ended up winning. What? Goku's coming back from the other world to enter the world tournament? Well, how come you didn't tell me sooner? This is great! Goten, you'll finally get to spend a day with your dad! Huh? Oh no, I bet Goku hasn't aged at all, but I look so much older! You don't age there, right? Uh, uh, so... Mom, Champion gets 10 million zenny. 10 million zenny? You're entering, Gohan! If you and Goku both win, we'll get 15 million zenny, right? Well, that's if we win. We can't say for sure whether we will or not just yet. What are you talking about? Of course you two will win! Oh, this must be a blessing from above! All of my father's money was just about to run out! So, Goten, you want to help your big brother train? Yeah! Thanks for waiting, Goten. First, let's start off with a little sparring match. Okay. First, I'll turn into a Super Saiyan. Ha! Come at me. Hey, that's not fair. Can I go Super Saiyan too? Huh? Super Saiyan? <laughs> I don't think you're ready for that just yet, Goten. Goten! Whoa! Nice! Um... I forget! Unbelievable! Alright, let's do this! Yeah! You better take a break from school. Focus on your training. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
Enough for now. Okay. Man, I didn't count on you going Super Saiyan, Goten. You know, you're actually helping me out a ton. Great job. <laughs> Hold on a second. So, does that mean Trunks can become a Super Saiyan too? Yeah, just like me. <laughs> You know, your big brother really had to struggle to become one. Well, anyway, I think that's enough training for everyone today. Okay. Are you sure you're not here to ask my Gohan out on a date? I said that's not why I'm here. Oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Looks like you found the place pretty easy. Yeah, I just looked in the school directory. But enough of that. You promised you'd teach me how to fly, remember? Oh, uh, yeah, right. Of course, I'll teach you. Hmm. You'd better not try anything naughty with my Gohan. You hear me? I'd never do anything like that. Ew, no! <laughs> well, so much for a simple training session. You did it! You're airborne! You're floating! Phew! That was incredible! You learned how to float in just one day! Yeah, well... Your little brother's been flying circles around me in the same amount of time! Well, that's because he was able to learn how to control his energy early on in his... But, once you get the hang of that, you'll be up and flying in no time at I'll all! I'll be back tomorrow, then! Huh? I want to learn more about this energy! Or is my coming back a problem? N n no way. It's not like that at all. Then I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, yeah. That reminds me. What? Uh, about your hair. I think uh, you should cut it shorter. Huh? So you prefer girls with short hair? Is that it? What? Uh, no, I, I just thought having shorter hair would be advantageous in, you know, in a fight. Mind your own business. It's my hair, so I'll do what I want with it. Why, why did she get all angry like that? <sighs> Beats me. Okay, let's pick up where we left off yesterday. Yeah, I don't understand this girl at all. Don't overdo it, Trunks. You should still get out while you can. 150 times gravity is too much for a kid like you. <sighs> yep, that's what I thought. I better become a Super Saiyan before I get crushed! What the? <laughs> piece of cake, piece of cake! W when... when did he... you've got to be kidding me! He was able to transform into the Super Saiyan of legend that easily? Trunks. Yeah? Can Gohan's little brother also become a Super Saiyan? Tell me! Yeah. What is this? Some sort of Super Saiyan bargain sale? Damn it! What the hell is this world coming to? Wow! Fidel's really something else. She's flying like a pro now. And she's only been at it for ten days. Ah, <sighs> now that that's taken care of, I can finally get some serious training in with Goten. Not too much longer now until Dad comes back and the tournament starts. With the tournament fast approaching, 
each bright-eyed and hopeful participant poured all of their energy into finishing their training. All right! At last, the day had arrived, the day of the long-awaited World Tournament. It's finally the day of the tournament. I need to stay focused if I want to win.